Time to go to 40. Good morning, here we are, it's day number 11 of my freediving training in Dahab, Egypt. I'm here with Brian Crossland from Blue Ocean Freedivers and it's a big day today. It's my last day. What are we going to do today? Well, if everything's going to go well, then we're going to do a nice dive, constant work dive to 40 meters. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> do you think I can do it? Yes. I wouldn't be setting the line if I didn't think you could do it. All right. You just gotta keep relaxed, don't try harder, don't try to swim faster. Just keep doing what you've been doing for the past 10 days and you will have absolutely no problem with the dance. Yeah, I have, to, I have to try to not look up this time. I think yesterday again I looked up to the thing and really to fall from 20 meters on and, and not use too many fin kicks. Yeah. Just yeah. let yourself fall, just yeah. let yourself fall, just yeah. let yourself fall. So I'm now here doing the first warm-up dive. It's just going down slowly, doing free immersion, meaning you're pulling on the rope so you're not using too much energy of your legs and trying to stay um, down as long as you can just to uh, make the mammalian dive reflex kick in. We humans evolved from the oceans some 530 million years ago. And maybe that's why we still carry around a set of physiological functions called the mammalian dive reflex. A reflex which kicks in once your face is submerged in water, designed to help us and other mammals to spend long periods of time without breathing. To trigger the mammalian dive reflex, your face needs to be wet. The colder the water, the better. And then two things happen your heart rate slows down and your blood vessels constrict, limiting the blood flow to your peripheral organs and extremities, keeping the blood where it's most important for your heart, lungs and your brain. Before every deep dive, you try to trigger the mammalian dive reflex as much as you can without using your legs, a so-called warm-up dive. Slowly, you pull yourself down the line, saving the energy in your legs giving the mammalian dive reflex a chance to kick in. And when you're back at the surface, you're ready for your deep dive. So, I just did my second warm-up dive and it's now time to do the 40 meters. Ah.
Oh, oh my god, I did it. This feels like a big relief. And I'm going out of the water now, I'm done. Yeah, it was 20 seconds more actually. Yeah, cool. Yeah. So and it could still be a little bit longer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have to learn that. Like I was free falling for a time and then did some pin kicks just to speed up. And actually, because the reason I re reached 41.5 is I went pretty fast at the end, so I, I was actually stopped by the ball. <laughs> <laughs> so. What, what I find so astonishing is that three weeks ago I could have never imagined doing this. I yes. had the terrible feeling in my stomach at seven meters. So how do you explain this progress? And I mean, you're not allowed to say it because of your exceptional speaking, uh, teaching skills. Of course, that's the case. No, it's not me that's done it. It's you that's done it. Well, you're, you're a great teacher, yeah. I have to say. So, but 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 how else can can you explain that? But you, you've got the skill, you've got the ability to do it, and you've just got to have somebody who can uh, help you realise what you're capable of. Yeah. Hmm. You think that's it? So it's, do you think it's only psychological? Do you think the, the training, the, the breathing, the stretching and all that, did, did that have any effect? Okay. Oh, all, all goes together. Okay. You've got to do everything. You've got to have a level of fitness. You've got to have a level of flexibility. Yeah. You've got to have a level of relax. So. Amazing. Do you think every, everybody can, can do this? With enough training? With enough time, yes. yes. Okay. Not the speed that you've done it. Okay. You know, everybody's, uh, most people take on average three months. For 40 meters? For 40 meters. Oh, somebody <laughs> I'm glad you didn't tell me that in advance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Well, thank you for all of this. This is amazing, and I'll be back soon. Well done, mate. Thanks. Congratulations. If you and everybody around you is doing the same thing every day for the past 11 days, whatever you're doing feels like the most normal thing. Heading to the airport in the car, leaving Dahab and free diving behind for some time, I gain some perspective. What the fuck did I just do? What the hell are we actually doing? Taking one deep breath and rocketing into the deep dark ocean? A whole infrastructure of gear, teachers and schools helping people to dive into black holes? Before doing this, I would have thought these people are crazy. But now, having been down there, I am one of them. I'll be back there soon, close to the edge. So alive. <laughs>